Every single child is an individual. Every child has their own particular makeup, personality, and quirks. Some children are quiet and shy, others are loud and boisterous. Some are blessed with creative talents, while others are sporty. One child will walk around with his head in a book, as the other acts out all the characters in the book. Your child may enjoy painting epic masterpieces, yet your next door neighbor's child may enjoy throwing paint colors against a fence in the backyard. That's the wonderful thing about life. We all come in different shapes and different sizes, differing skin colors, and from different backgrounds with wildly differing points of view. That is what makes life interesting. I mean, imagine if we're all the same. Life would certainly be dull if we were all pre programmed robots. If our homes were all decorated the same. If we all spoke the same way. Listen to the same music or watch the same movies and wore the same clothes. Yet today, many children from a very young age feel the weight of peer pressure. To conform, to be like their friends, to do what they do. Speak the same way, dress the same, see the right movies, be the perfect shape and size, listen to the right music. Don't dare to be different, don't dare to be yourself. And that is the way children feel. And these days, children can feel that way from a very young age. Bill the Fish celebrates individuality. It teaches children through a series of wildly differing aquatic characters that we're all meant to be different. See characters that come in all shapes and sizes, some have spots, while others have stripes. Some have hats and have friends made of jelly, or live in shells, or are spiky. Through wonderful and colourful paintings created by award winning artist Brett Curzon, Bill the Fish. Takes us to a world under the sea and teaches children that it's okay to be yourself, quirks and all.